Hello and welcome to Breathwood. My name is David Yates and I'm here to talk about circular breathing again. Yeah, this uh, crazy technique just won't go away. So here are some newer tips. You have to be able to play a drone. Okay, you don't have to play the drone if you do the water thing. But to really get it on the ditch, you have to be able to play a drone. You've got the drone going. If it's airy, if there's a lot of air sound coming out, you gotta work on that. <laughs> so if your lips start like this and you blow, just get air and you start to close them gently until they catch the air. They vibrate, but there's still air sound. You could probably squeeze a little closer together. You'll hear the notes dramatically increase in pitch by a half to a whole step. That's when you've got the drone, when there's less of an air sound and more of just the straightforward vibration sound. <clears throat> That's important because circular breathing is about maintaining pressure to maintain your lip buzz. And if your drone is really airy, then you'll be losing air while you're trying to breathe. And uh, every time you lose air, you lose pressure, and it makes the whole thing harder. So clarify the drone. Keep working on it. Keep getting it. To get to that point. Then I'm going to try something with you that I haven't shown many other people yet. I want you to catch the pressure. Step one, inflate your cheeks while you're playing. Step two, take a breath, quick sniff in your nose, and notice what happens to your cheeks. Probably this. Do you see what happens? The cheeks suddenly deflate. Where does the pressure go? Does it go down the throat into the lungs? Does it go out the lips? It just goes away. <clears throat> It goes to that place where lost pressure goes. We got to catch it. How do you catch pressure in your mouth? Well, I'll try this. And now breathe in and out your nose. <laughs> Tickles. That's how you catch pressure. Here. And for now, we're closing the lips. And back here, the back of the mouth and the tongue are closed from ah to ah. Mm, mm. It's all closed back there. You can feel that if you open your mouth and breathe in and out your nose. So fill your cheeks up. Hold it. Breathe in and out. You've caught the pressure. <clears throat> so, here's a little test. Blow the drum, inflate the cheeks, then just stop and catch the pressure. This might happen instead. You let the pressure go. So you gotta catch from back here, catch here. Now you have something to work with. If you can catch the pressure like that, you are 80% mm, of the way there. The last piece, well, there's two pieces. The next piece <laughs> is to use the pressure from your mouth to make a vibration in the lips.
That's what basically happens when you pause to breathe in. That pressure caught here keeps your lips vibrating so you can breathe in or out. <laughs> so now, here's the next part. Blow the drum, inflate the cheeks, catch the pressure, and then see if you can release the pressure and breathe in and make some kind of vibration with the lips. So drone, inflate, catch the pressure, and breathe in and squeeze at the same time. I did it, I was kind of delayed there. <clears throat> and then five, blow again. Blow in, inflate the cheeks. Catch the pressure. Squeeze and vibrate and breathe. Blow again. And eventually, when you use the pressure in the mouth to squeeze and make the lips keep vibrating, they vibrate at the right speed and you get the drone. But wait, when you get circular breathing, aren't you supposed to have this like super clear, smooth drone like this? No, <laughs> you're not. That is high level circular breathing. When you can have a smooth drone with very little break in sound while you circular breathe, that means you have fine, fine tuned control over the back of your mouth, your tongue, your cheeks, your breathing, your diaphragm, your lips. At first, when you learn to circular breathe, it should sound like a bit of a pulse. It'll sound more like that, like a wah or a wah sound. Wah, wah. More like that. In fact, when I first learned, my teacher had me go do, do, boom, do, do, boom. That helped me separate, fill, pressurize, and then squeeze and breathe. Broke it down into two separate parts, and eventually they get smoothed out. Once again, blow the drone, fill, pressurize. You can combine that into one step if you want. Catch the pressure. Breathe in, squeeze the pressure at the same time. Blow again. Blow, fill. So the key here is to be able to do this. One little side tip, don't get in the habit of playing with your cheeks inflated. That's just when you want to pressurize and then breathe in. The rest of the time, keep the cheeks pulled in if possible. <laughs> Okay, in, 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 then out, then circular breathe. Circular breathing is not circular breathing. It is continuous outward pressure, whether that pressure is from the lungs and the diaphragm or your face, <laughs> face pressure. Okay, so I hope that helps. Learn to catch the pressure and then learn to use that pressure to vibrate your lips which is no small task. You have to separate this part of your face from the rest of it. And usually we're used to having it all work together when we talk. That's why it's such a weird thing. And we're used to breathing in between doing all of those things. <sighs> all right, so uh, thanks so much for watching. 
If you want to support more videos like this, check the link below and join Patreon. You can support these videos and more on a monthly basis at different levels of rewards. I'm also going to learn from my teacher Dubrovko in Croatia in the summer. That link is below. You can support that journey if you want to see me get there and learn a bunch of stuff and come back and process it and talk about it and teach what I ever can teach. I won't be teaching what Dubrovko teaches. That's for him to teach, but I'll teach what I can teach after I learn to do what he does. Okay, makes sense. <laughs> Um, and as always, I appreciate your comments and support and encouragement so much. Click subscribe, uh, click like and all that. Share with your friends. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if this helps you. I'd love to hear your comments. And uh, as always, happy playing. See you soon.